All right, all right, it is Tuesday. We are, what is it now, three days away from me doing my first triathlon, my first half Ironman. Predictions for the swim, I'm guessing about 45, 50 minutes. I'm not the best swimmer, I only started swimming two months ago. So yeah, that's gonna be the weakest link. Bike is gonna be three or just start on sub three, hopefully sub three. Um, yeah, should be good because closed course, or pretty much I think the majority of it's closed course and no traffic lights and yeah, that should be good. So hopefully around 250 for that run. I uh, did the practice about a month ago and I did a 157 half marathon and that was with traffic lights and lots of people around and not on a closed course. So um, hopefully 150. If I can go sub 150, that would be awesome. So yeah, sub six overall. That's um, the aim. Haven't really practiced the transition a whole lot, but um, I did do moving dismount off the bike, and that worked well. I need to practice the um, hopping on the bike, but uh, I don't think it should be too much of a problem, to be honest. Other thoughts? Um, I'm feeling good. I kind of yeah did one more hard training session recently on the previous weekend, and I'm pretty much just taking it easy this week, and yeah, I'll be into it. So. Um, I'd say a little bit nervous for the swim, that's about the only part, I'm just, my plan is to, um, or yeah, race plan, um, go off to the side, my age group is third group off the line, so uh, it's pretty well up there, and um, yeah, I'm just going to go move off to the side, I'm going to breaststroke the swim because I can't free that whole distance, um, I will try and mix a bit of free in there as well, just so it speeds it up a little bit, and yeah, I'll just kind of stay out of the chaos because, um, yeah, not really keen to get into the mix with that, and then um, after that, just yeah, once I'm on the bike, go nuts, um, pretty much. Obviously, save something for the run, but um, yeah, just uh, up the ante. For food, I'm gonna have uh, between three to five bananas for breakfast before the event, and some water, and then I'm gonna take um, two bananas to transition, and my drink bottles on the bike are just gonna be filled with water and sugar, so sugar water. And then um, from there, oh, well the plan is to have both bananas and down both drink bottles on the bike and um, even if I don't really feel like it, completely down it. That way when I get to the run, all I really will want will be water and that'll be a bit more simple basically, so hopefully um, less kind of moving off to the side to get drinks and stopping at aid, well not stopping, but cruising through aid stations, so I think I should be pretty right at that stage. And then yeah, um, r running pace off the bike, um, I was thinking about trying to go 5.10 but I think I'm probably going to just start it around 5.15, 5.20 and then from perhaps K number 16, 17 with 3 to 4 to go, then um, yeah, see if I can bring it down and bring it down as best I can. But I want to finish um, completely spent, I don't want to kind of save or feel like I could have give, given more on the day. I want to finish um, as hard as I can, basically. So um, yeah, those last few Ks, I'll put my body through um, all it can handle, basically. And yeah, that's my plan, basically. So um, I will do, I'd say, a bit of a vlog going down there, and then um, of us, my family, who are coming down to film what they can. It starts very early, it starts at 6.30 in the morning, so I um, don't expect to get a whole lot of footage, but um, yeah, I will put some of it on my channel as well, and I will do a full recap with all my experiences, and I have written down some questions to basically, well, questions that I wanted answered, because I'm new to triathlon, and I will answer them after. So I will bring up those questions and um, yeah, answer them and do a recap after it. Wish me luck.